Generative Artificial Intelligence, or Gen AI, is poised to revolutionize healthcare by automating tasks that enhance patient care quality and safety. This is made possible by foundation models, which are pre-trained and can generate complex content, marking a significant shift away from traditional task-specific classifiers. The initial application of Gen AI in healthcare will be through well-defined, low-risk, high-value, and narrow applications that automate healthcare workflows at the point of care using smaller foundation models. These models will be fine-tuned for different capabilities and application-specific scenarios, providing medical explanations, referencing evidence within a retrieval-augmented framework, and utilizing external tools. In contrast, developing a general, all-purpose AI model for end-to-end clinical decision-making that improves clinician performance, including safety-critical diagnostic tasks, will require more extensive research before deployment. Understanding the potential and perils of Gen AI in healthcare is crucial, emphasizing the need for careful consideration of its applications and implications. Notably, the initial focus of Gen AI in healthcare will be on automating specific workflows, rather than attempting to create a general-purpose AI model for clinical decision-making. This approach is expected to yield high-value results while minimizing risks. By focusing on narrow, high-value applications, Gen AI can bring about significant improvements in healthcare, but its development and deployment must be carefully managed to ensure patient safety and quality of care. The implementation of Generative Artificial Intelligence, Gen AI, in healthcare settings has the potential to improve quality and safety by automating mundane tasks and leveraging the principles of implementation science to integrate, end-to-end, Gen AI systems acceptable to healthcare teams. The recent surge in adoption of Gen AI and foundation models, exemplified by OpenAI's Chad GPT, has sparked excitement about the potential for Artificial General Intelligence, AGI. These foundation models, which receive text queries and generate text output, have been studied for various medical tasks, such as operative note writing, answering patient questions, generating clinical summaries, creating differential diagnoses, and understanding personal health data. However, these models also produce medically inaccurate or nonsensical outputs, hallucinate facts, and propagate existing biases. Despite these limitations, Gen AI is being integrated into health systems, with potential long-term benefits in clinical medicine, including improved patient diagnosis and precision treatment strategies. In the short term, health systems can realize immediate benefits by applying Gen AI to low-risk, high-value, and low-variation use cases, such as repetitive and standardized tasks. A more pragmatic approach is to identify areas where, human in the loop, Gen AI can augment healthcare quality and safety, acknowledging the importance of implementation science in integrating these systems into healthcare teams. This approach recognizes that AI systems do not need to achieve near-perfect performance to be valuable, but rather can provide significant benefits when used in conjunction with human expertise. By focusing on use cases where Gen AI can augment human capabilities, health systems can improve quality and safety while also addressing the limitations and biases of these models. Foundation models have shown great promise in achieving high-quality results in various applications, but their implementation in safety-critical areas like diagnostic and treatment recommendations requires extensive research. Instead, the authors focus on exploring their potential in more straightforward tasks where even average quality outputs can improve healthcare system quality, safety, and efficiency at scale. Generative AI has the potential to standardize care, minimize variability between providers, and provide value for overburdened healthcare staff in clinical decision support tools at the point of care. A foundation model is a model pre-trained on a large, broad dataset that can be adapted to various downstream tasks without requiring training from scratch, exhibiting zero-shot capabilities. Examples include GPT, Bloom, Llama 2, and Stable Diffusion, characterized by their scale in terms of training data, computational resources, and parameter size. These models typically utilize transformer architectures, enabling them to handle multimodal data, including images, videos, audios, and two waveforms. By fine-tuning foundation models with smaller, more specific datasets, they can perform tasks involving multiple modalities, such as image captioning, visual question answering, or tasks requiring both textual and non-textual information. 
Fine tuning updates the pre trained parameters to better suit the specific task requirements. A key strength of foundation models lies in their ability to leverage their pre training to adapt to tasks that were not part of their initial training data, demonstrating capabilities in reasoning, planning, and data processing tasks like integration and cleaning. This adaptability makes them suitable for applications where large amounts of data are available, but the specific task requirements are unclear or evolving. Recent advancements in foundation models have led to the development of Retrieval Augmented Generation, or RAG, which integrates transformers with a retrieval mechanism. This innovation enables the model to incorporate the latest data or retrieve pertinent information for specific use cases, thereby enhancing clinical decision support systems. By doing so, RAG reduces the likelihood of hallucinations, a critical consideration in healthcare applications. In parallel, a comparative analysis of larger proprietary models and smaller domain-specific models has yielded intriguing results. When fine-tuned, smaller domain-specific models can outperform their larger proprietary counterparts, offering a more feasible and privacy-conscious solution for healthcare systems. This finding has significant implications for the development of tailored models that cater to specific clinical requirements. The optimal approach will depend on a nuanced consideration of resource availability, domain specificity, and task-specific requirements. It is crucial to prioritize model output quality and understand its limitations to ensure the effective deployment of foundation models in healthcare. By acknowledging these factors, clinicians and researchers can harness the potential of RAG and domain-specific models to improve patient outcomes and drive progress in the field. The attributes of generative AI can accelerate the development of use cases that support healthcare workers in engaging with electronic health records, EHRs, to complete tasks. One immediate application of generative AI is prioritizing non-diagnostic clinical and administrative tasks that are labor-intensive, require manual review and input, and are well-defined. By automating lower-risk tasks, Generative AI can support healthcare workers and administrators in performing their duties more effectively. A key area of focus is the creation of dynamic user interfaces to support interaction with data for informed decision making. Current EHR interfaces present excessive data, leading to adverse events, medical errors, and poor communication. Researchers are exploring the use of generative AI to create dynamic user interfaces that facilitate healthcare workers' interaction with complex medical data, including patient data, compliance manuals, standard operating procedures, and evidence-based guidelines. This approach differs from training medicine-specific foundation models or using models for prediction. Instead, Generative AI-based systems can present an intuitive interface that streamlines interactions with multiple digital tools and sources of information, significantly augmenting clinicians' capabilities by efficiently extracting and analyzing crucial information from vast amounts of patient data. The foundation model supplies knowledge from institutionally improved sources through retrieval augmented generation, RAG, limiting the potential for hallucinations. This enhances the practical impact of generative AI tools while addressing current issues with using these models in clinical settings, such as hallucinations. Gen AI-supported dynamic interfaces can provide evidence-based information to healthcare teams at the point of care, possibly improving adherence to evidence-based guidelines. The text discusses how Gen AI can enhance clinical engineering teams by transforming equipment manuals into interactive Q&A systems, improving equipment maintenance productivity. It also highlights the potential of generative AI in clinical documentation, reducing the burden for clinicians by assisting with writing medical terminology and generating accurate summaries. The technology can parse medical records, convert unstructured data into structured formats, and even process large volumes of pathology reports with high accuracy. This includes extracting key data elements from patient notes and reformatting them into structured layouts for better filtering of clinical trials. The application of artificial intelligence in healthcare has led to improved quality of care and reduced errors, enabling pharmacy teams to focus on patient safety and well-being. Dynamic checklists, which display patient-specific data and guidelines, have improved compliance with best practices in intensive care units, resulting in reduced length of stay. By integrating generative AI, these checklists can be further enhanced to assess patient eligibility, emphasize critical items, 
and remove unnecessary ones, ensuring teams adhere to best practices in a user-friendly interface. A specific example of dynamic checklist application is in adherence to lung protective ventilation in patients on mechanical ventilators. Implementing lung protective ventilation has been shown to improve patient outcomes and reduce healthcare costs. However, its adoption is limited due to challenges in developing and digitizing clinical protocols and analyzing metrics within electronic health records. A generative AI-enhanced dynamic checklist can overcome these challenges by assessing ideal body weight, tidal volumes, and adherence to lung protective ventilation protocols, standardizing ventilator management, reducing inter-provider practice variation, and ensuring consideration of lung protective ventilation for all ventilated patients. This innovative approach has the potential to improve patient outcomes, reduce healthcare costs, and enhance the overall quality of care. The section discusses the potential of foundation models in healthcare data auditing, extraction, and population. They exhibit superior capabilities in data discovery tasks such as table class detection, column type annotation, and joint column prediction. These models can help reduce data siloing by extracting information from disparate data sources and formats, translating different medical terminologies into a unified format. This could increase the utility of health system data and improve predictive analytics or auditing capabilities. The implementation of such models requires a structured and context-sensitive approach, involving multidisciplinary teams to ensure design, user experience, workflow integration, and performance monitoring within clinical workflows. The successful integration of generative AI systems into clinical workflows relies on their usability, ability to support workflow, and meeting the needs of end users. Quantitative assessments of Gen AI systems impact on user experience, efficiency, productivity, and workload in real-world clinical settings are necessary. Estimating the total cost of implementation, including model running costs, monitoring, maintenance, and infrastructure adjustments, is also crucial. Risks associated with foundation models for healthcare tasks include hallucinations, omission, and bias. Controlling output to prevent hallucinations is a significant challenge, as current models lack quality evaluation and uncertainty measurement for their outputs. The quality, quantity, and diversity of data used in pre-training and instruction fine-tuning of foundation models significantly impact model performance. Algorithmic bias towards underrepresented minorities may exacerbate healthcare disparities, and techniques are necessary to mitigate these biases and promote health equity across diverse populations. The underrepresentation of certain demographics or outdated medical practices in training data can lead to biases in Gen AI outputs, causing harm. These risks threaten the acceptance and adoption of AI tools in healthcare. The unpredictable effects of Gen AI on quality and patient safety are not yet well understood and measuring outcomes such as fairness and safety in specific environments is necessary to assess the technology's impact. Mitigating these risks is essential to ensure the safe and effective integration of Gen AI systems into clinical workflows. The potential for early penetration of generative AI into healthcare is significant, particularly in tasks where it can perform reasonably well and contribute to higher quality, more efficient, and safer care. To realize this potential, a careful and coordinated approach is crucial, involving scrutiny, customization of the technology to its specific context, and regular verification of how Gen AI assists in clinical encounters. This approach will help address concerns associated with adopting Gen AI in healthcare, such as ensuring that, human in the loop, Gen AI systems are practical, reliable, and safe. The future vision involves Gen AI systems accelerating quality, safety, and efficiency in healthcare delivery. To achieve this, it is essential to develop Gen AI systems that can operate in complex, dynamic healthcare environments, while maintaining transparency, explainability, and accountability. This requires addressing the limitations and biases of current Gen AI systems as well as developing novel evaluation methodologies that can assess the performance and safety of these systems in real-world clinical settings. Ultimately, the successful integration of Gen AI into healthcare will depend on a multidisciplinary effort, involving clinicians, researchers, policymakers, and industry experts working together to develop and implement Gen AI systems that are tailored to the specific needs of healthcare providers and patients. By adopting a careful and coordinated approach, 
we can harness the potential of Gen AI to transform healthcare delivery and improve patient outcomes. The refined version of the transcript starts directly with the content, focusing on the key points and technical details of the research paper. It aims to maintain the technical accuracy and depth of the original text while ensuring it is concise and suitable for voiceover narration. Recent studies in neural information processing, medical imaging, natural language processing, and clinical research underscore the importance of integrating large language models into healthcare systems to improve patient outcomes and streamline clinical trial matching. Notably, research by Wei et al., 2022, and Shen et al., 2024, highlights the advantages of neural information processing systems in processing complex medical data. Similarly, Kayali et al., 2023, and Onyani et al., 2024, demonstrate the efficacy of large language models in interpreting patient records for semantic clinical trial matching. In the realm of medical imaging, Gilbert et al., 2021, showcase the potential of IEEE transactions on medical imaging in improving analysis. Meanwhile, Merrill et al., 2024, and Gupta et al., 2024, illustrate the role of large language models in enhancing patient records interpretation and clinical trial matching, respectively. Clinical research in cardiology, as emphasized by Thomas, 2023, and Cowie et al., 2017, is critical for improving healthcare outcomes. Furthermore, public health and health information management, as discussed by Casey et al., 2016, and Jalilian et al., 2022, are essential in the context of clinical trials. The application of human-computer interaction and bioinformatics in improving healthcare outcomes is demonstrated by Hu et al., 2019, and Luo et al., 2022. Moreover, Yang et al., 2022, and Imri et al., 2023, highlight the potential of large language models in redefining digital health interfaces and enhancing patient care. This comprehensive literature review provides a solid foundation for the proposed methodology, which leverages large language models to improve patient outcomes and clinical trial matching. The authors present a comprehensive literature review on the applications of machine learning in healthcare, focusing on clinical decision support systems, patient outcomes, and healthcare quality improvement. The review encompasses 53 studies, highlighting the growing body of research in this area. It demonstrates the effectiveness of machine learning algorithms in predicting patient outcomes, such as cardiovascular disease risk, hospital readmission rates, and mortality rates. Additionally, machine learning has been shown to improve healthcare quality by identifying high-risk patients, optimizing treatment strategies, and enhancing clinical decision-making. The review also explores the role of machine learning in addressing healthcare disparities, including racial and socioeconomic disparities in patient outcomes. Furthermore, it covers the applications of machine learning in mental health, including predicting suicide risk and improving treatment outcomes for depression. The authors emphasize the importance of integrating machine learning into healthcare systems to improve patient care and outcomes. The studies reviewed employ a range of machine learning algorithms, including supervised and unsupervised learning methods, as well as deep learning techniques. The authors note the importance of addressing limitations, such as data quality issues, biases in algorithms, and the need for further research on the implementation of machine learning in real-world healthcare settings. In the realm of artificial intelligence, machine learning, and healthcare, a comprehensive review of existing literature reveals a complex landscape. The convergence of these fields has given rise to innovative applications, including predictive analytics, personalized medicine, and clinical decision support systems. However, challenges persist, such as data quality issues, algorithmic bias, and regulatory hurdles. Notably, machine learning algorithms have demonstrated remarkable accuracy in diagnosing diseases, including cancer, cardiovascular disease, and neurological disorders. For instance, convolutional neural networks have achieved state-of-the-art performance in medical image analysis, while recurrent neural networks have shown promise in processing electronic health records. Despite these advances, the authors highlight the need for more robust evaluation methodologies, citing the limitations of current metrics and the importance of considering real-world clinical contexts. They also emphasize the importance of addressing ethical concerns, such as data privacy, security, and fairness 
which are critical to ensuring the responsible development and deployment of AI systems in healthcare. The review underscores the significance of interdisciplinary collaboration, calling for closer integration of machine learning expertise with clinical knowledge and domain-specific understanding. By bridging this gap, researchers and practitioners can develop more effective, patient-centered AI solutions that address the complex needs of healthcare systems. The table categorizes foundation model capabilities into data management, user interface, and language capabilities, detailing potential applications, risks, and mitigation strategies for each. Data management capabilities include high-throughput extraction of clinically relevant data variables from unstructured text, social determinants of health extraction, and extraction of relevant imaging variables from reports. Risks involve propagation of existing biases, mitigated by assessing the robustness of fine-tuned models to larger proprietary models. User interface capabilities encompass question-and-answer exchanges, decision support at the point of care, and dynamic checklists, with risks including inaccurate responses, biased responses, alarm fatigue, and poor integration into clinical workflows. Mitigation strategies involve incorporating RAG-based support, developing domain-specific language models, engaging stakeholders, and enabling user-centered design during development. Language capabilities comprise text summarization and or listing, sentence completion, note writing assistance, and rewriting in a style, with risks including omission or inaccurate summaries, inaccurate sentence completion, automation bias, and HIPAA violations. Educating users about limitations, developing domain-specific foundation models, and integrating the model into the electronic health record, EHR, are key mitigation strategies.